This is the Wow Ho Hin channel. Welcome to Wow Ho Hin channel. Today, I am with Kun Simon Yates. He's the professional golfer. Correct. Yeah, that's correct. Nice to meet you. Nice ka. to meet you too, Sawadee ka. Thank you so much for having us here to great. do the interview. No, brilliant. Yeah. Wow. Look at the view here. right here behind us. Yeah, it's uh, it's a nice place to live. Yeah, Black Mountain. Yeah, I really enjoy it. It looks fantastic here. How did you become a professional golfer? Uh, actually, my my father was a very good golfer. He was a scratch uh, handicapper, and he never turned professional when he was young in in what the nineteen sixties, early seventies. So. <laughs> I'm sure he was very happy. I turned professional in 1989 in Scotland. I turned professional. I did five years of um, of basically my apprenticeship. Ah. I got my PGA Professional Golfers Association card, um, and from then on, I went to Germany for six months. Ah. Uh, went went to play some tournaments. Won the German PGA Championship, and never looked back. And came to Thailand mm -hmm. uh, for a holiday for six weeks with my friend, and. Um, yeah, just had a great time and thought, you know, I quite like to come and live in Thailand. The so, weather totally different, right, from where you live. Yeah, yeah <laughs> Scotland, you get a lot of rain. I think most people know we get a lot of rain, yeah. uh, snow, sleet, um, yeah. and it's cold compared to here. But you know, living in in Thailand, it's such a a beautiful country. We all love it here. Yeah. Um, as you see, many foreigners come to retire here. Yeah. And yeah, I, I, I basically from 1994 to 2019 played the Asian uh, tour, Ka. professional golf tour. So Ka. I really had a great uh, life doing that. Ka. And I'm sort of semi-retired, now a senior, thinking about playing some senior tour events in Thailand and okay. possibly Japan. I went to Japan three years ago, okay. got my card. So basically uh, I've got the option to go to Japan. But Ka. obviously the last two years with COVID, Everything stayed still, everyone mm, stayed here, yeah. so it's been difficult, but now hopefully, cross the fingers, we're, we're out of uh, COVID times and uh, things will be better. Ka Hua Hin is your second home, right? And you're a golfer, like, how many places, like, golf courses that you've been, like, in Hua Hin? Oh, have you been all over? I've been around the world playing golf, um, from... Uh, World Golf Championships. Yeah. Uh, I think just playing on Asian Tour, I think the highest ranking I got was 144 in the world. So, yeah, yeah I had a great career on the Asian Tour. I was third in the order of merit three, uh, two times, six in the order of merit three, four times. So through that period, I had a lot of good years. Yeah. So, yeah, I just had a great time playing golf, traveling, yeah. seeing a lot of Asia, yeah. Europe as well. And, and yeah, it was, it was a really good time for me. Yeah. So, how did you know about Hua Hin? Like, why did you choose this place to be your second home? Well, interesting, I had a friend, Kenny Walker, who uh, said to me, um, just when I graduated and got my exams as a professional golfer, said, okay. do you fancy coming to Thailand for six weeks? Mm -hmm. And after that, I was going on to Germany to teach um, golf for um, 1995, that was, 1994. Okay. Um, so... I came here for six weeks holiday with them, played Royal Wahin, played Majestic, Ka. Lakeview, Springfield, and just was just like, oh, this is paradise. This mm -hmm. is, a, and that's the time when we're sending postcards going home. So things have changed a lot, Ka. and uh, yeah, just had a great time. And I had a year in Germany, won the German PGA Championship, and wow. came over here, never looked back, and played the Asian Tour ever since then. So really, Ka. yeah, I really was lucky in my. And you're Fortunate. lucky to, to live, you know, have a really nice house next to the golf course. Yeah, Black Mountain started up like 13 years ago and I was sort of involved yeah. in helping the owner uh, find land and, 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 and do stuff. And, yeah. and to be honest, um, Black Mountain has a, it's really well known around, I'd say pretty much the world now. I mean, yeah. I was in Scotland one time playing golf uh, and I was just with my family in a restaurant and this man came up to me and said, Black Mountain? He says, I've been there, I've played there. Have you played there too? And I said, I live there. And he oh, goes, wow. no, you don't. Uh, you can't live. I said, I do. Look, my Thai's for the Thai family. Ha. And he's like, really? You are so lucky, he ha. said. And I said, yeah, we are very lucky. So, yeah, it's just a, it's an amazing place. Wahin is a, is a town. Um, I wouldn't move anywhere else in, in Thailand because we just love Wahin. It's a, a great place. Ha. Have you been like all over Thailand like before you choose like to be in Hua Hin? Like, uh, I traveled a lot. Yes, I, I traveled a lot and you know I've been to many places. We have a holiday place in Phuket. We ha. love Phuket as ha. 
beach, airplane. I mean, it's just a great place. There's so ah. many beautiful things about Phuket, but ah. as a family goes, I think Hua Hin is one of the nicest places in Thailand for sure. Wow, I agree with you. Yeah, well, <laughs> it's got the you. beach, it's got golf. It's ah. just a nice, lovely town, yeah. I, I'm not a golfer, okay? That's like, what would you recommend me if I, you know, I want to learn how to play golf? Like, what would you recommend? Well, you've like, got to go to the driving range first. <laughs> and, and I always recommend you go with a professional because huh. the fundamentals in golf are the most important things, like the way you grip the club, your stance, huh. your body alignment, your posture. Mm -hmm. These things are very important. If you go to the range yourself and you get it wrong, it's very difficult to play golf because these things aren't right. So huh. a professional to give you three, four, five lessons in a row huh. to get you the right fundamentals mm -hmm. and once you've got that golf becomes much easier huh. so anyone out there who's never had lessons it's quite difficult if they got things wrong because huh. it's difficult to change it feels very strange but huh. yeah there's many local pros here there's Jurgen at Black Mountain John Wither at Banyan so huh. yeah if you guys anyone out there wants lessons then uh, you can uh, go and get lessons from these guys huh. Um, the next one, like I saw, like when I met you downstairs, I saw you have a really, really nice car. Can you tell me a little bit, like, you know, the nice Tesla down there <laughs> that you have? Well, I never <laughs> thought of electric cars till a few years ago, and huh. I know in Thailand, that's the only thing I don't really like about Thailand. Cars are so expensive here because imported cars are, right, I think, two, three hundred percent tax, so huh. they're very expensive. Huh. But about, I remember about three years ago, I was looking at Teslas and I saw there was still a lot of money. And then suddenly, uh, recently, about nine months ago, I had a quick look on one to car. Okay. Teslas, they're much cheaper now, probably because the tax has come down because mm -hmm. it's all electric. Okay. So I went for a test drive in Bangkok okay. and I, I went with my wife to Bangkok and said, I'm not going to buy it. We're just going to have a test drive. And I bought it. So <laughs> it's, it's amazing. It's a great family car. Yeah. It's very smooth. The sound system's unbelievable. And the yeah. most impressive thing is the acceleration. It's unbelievable. There are only very few here, right? That, like, yeah, there, I think, well, one of my friends at Black Mountain went out in it and he just bought a BMW. And a week later, he went up and bought a Tesla. So, oh. And he never uses a BMW anymore. <laughs> never uses it. So it shows you he was impressed with it. And yeah, yeah everyone who goes in it, um, and I'm sure you guys, uh, I'll take you out in it. You'll be like, wow, it's, <laughs> it's, it's an amazing car, actually. Yeah. This is the Wow Ho Hin channel. Let's go and look at the Tesla. So tell me about your car. You. This is the first time I've actually sat in a Tesla, and yeah. it feels a bit like a sports car. Well, this is a performance model, but I think they're all very similar. I mean, the suspension, and this is upgraded brakes and maybe a different suspension to a normal. Mm. This is a Tesla 3. They have a standard performance. They have a long range, and they have a performance. And to be honest, um, yeah, I mean, for me, it's an amazing family car. If you want to is just it? cruise along, very smooth. Oh, your seat belts are going to go. This, uh, if you're not got your seat belts, you'll get the beep, beep, beep. Well, I did that on my car, and that drives me nuts. <laughs> so you're gonna, there you go. Not. There it goes. Let's do the seat belt up. That's Everyone, it. Everyone, put the seat belt I can't on. Even bloody fun. There it is. There we are. Okay, so we got the seat belt on. You've got a big screen in here. Uh, we do turn that to oh, the left. This is just an iPad. It's like iPad. watching a TV. I mean, you can watch Netflix and everything on it too. Yeah. So yeah. I mean, it's like. It's amazing. At the moment, Thailand hasn't got enough big chargers. The chargers like take 35, 40 minutes from empty to full. So if you're going long journeys, that's yeah, acceptable, right. which is great. But, but can you drive to Bangkok and back in this? Yeah, if I'm just doing 110 kilometers an hour, I can, yeah. yeah. But if you're doing faster than that, then it obviously it's like any car, the faster you go, the more, the more juice. juice it takes, yeah. the more batteries yeah. it takes. Yeah. No, I don't worry too much. Is uh, I'd like... Um, how many stations, charging stations are there around here at the moment? Uh, there's one at Tesco, I see it uh, at, uh, is it Tesco? Yeah, Lotus Tesco or, or Market Village, they have a big one, but only you'll be, when you see the acceleration, you won't be in a car like this acceleration. Mm. You'll probably get butterflies in your stomach, so that's why you've got to put your seatbelt on. 
It's very smooth. I know oh, it's smooth. Yeah, it's good. very and it's very comfortable. The seats are very, very comfortable. Yeah, they are. They're in time. Uh, very comfortable. That's and so, you've got a radio station on there. That's yeah, good. you've got your radio station. That's on all the time <laughs> going to school. But if we put the foot down, are you guys ready? Okay, are you ready? Ready? Uh, yeah. ready? Oh my, oh my God! God. Oh. <laughs> That's serious. That's it is unbelievable the torque. That, uh, that <laughs> I think all of you are having heart attacks. Uh, that was cool. That was but, seriously good. Trick. This is the unbelievable thing how the wheels don't, don't even spin with that power. I don't know, I wanna... It's only two wheel drive though, is it? Four. Oh, it's four. four. It's four. Yeah. Unbelievable. <laughs> it was like oh god. Very nice smooth car there. It's yeah, smooth. Fantastic. If you ever want to hear this sound system, see this across the front. It's a sound bar. When we, we come up to a car going slow, it's unbelievable how quickly you can overtake it. So we've got the speed here, right? Yeah, so speed. I don't expect you to go crazy, but just the acceleration. Right, there's nothing coming here. Are you ready? Right. Go. Oh my god. <laughs> so you're going for 40 to 110, just like oh. that. The whole experience of the car is incredible as is a battery car, but I researched everything about them before I bought them. I thought, yeah, it's important we get it right. If we want to just, we'll just give it a bit. Ready? Yeah. <laughs> and that's going uphill and you're up to that 100. Within a second or two, let's see what Security man's going. Oh, he loves it. They're all going. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it, 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 do you get anything in your stomach a little bit? Whoa. It's, it's just, uh, uh, it's terrific. It's sort of it's I'll give it, it gets you back in your seat. It's like a pond of roller coaster. Yeah, exactly. A lot of people say roller coaster ride, just the stomach just goes that way. Yeah. But yeah, the, the difference is this is 3.1 to 60 miles an hour. The long range is 4.2, which is still very, very fast. Mm. And the standard plus is 5.2, which is still quick. Tell me when you're ready. Okay. Ready? Yep. It's something that you don't really, it, you don't experience in normal cars. No. You don't get that uh, punch. Well, thank you very much for that. Well, that's that was good. good. Well, it's something you. different, Enjoyed isn't it? it? Enjoyed it. Thank I, you. I like to show people different things like technology. This is the Wow Ho Hin channel. Please like and subscribe to Wow Ho Hin.